Hello everyone and welcome to Kerbal Space Program. You do not understand how long I have wanted to play this game, but I almost feel too dumb for it because it's such a complicated game. I've only played 23 hours of it and I don't even think I've started up the game in 2014. I'm not completely sure, but it's been such a long time, but I think I can't remember how to play this game. So we're going to start off really simple and I'm just going to go to the moon and land on the moon. That might not be super simple for some people and it's probably not even super simple for me, but we're doing it. Okay. So obviously there's going to be some people watching who are really good at Kerbal Space Program or at least, uh, you know, more than I do. So if you have any suggestions, you, you know, you want to, you want to tell me while I'm playing that'll make the game better for me. You can certainly go ahead and do that. I think we just start off with one of these things that the, the lander can what is it called the M mk12 command pod i think that's i think that's the one and then we we got to add fuel right fuel is next so we'll just stick some fuel in here is this the right one nope that's not the right one aha i think this is the one wait this one too there this is the one okay so we need to have an rcs fuel tank right rcs is what keeps us kind of stable and whatnot when you're in space or something like that rocket controlled something or another <laughs> this is how much i know about Kerbal space program right here guys we also need to have one of these, right? An advanced reaction wheel or something. These are the things that keep you uh, keep you stable automatically so you don't have to do it because you hit a button and then it keeps you stable. Yeah, I should have done a tutorial or something before I did this, but no, Matt knows how to do this. Don't worry. All right, I'm going to put a parachute on the top as well because if we're going to try and bring this back to Earth, we're going to probably need one. And then you got to have your landing gear as well, right? And then we got to actually put rockets on it and stuff. But just, just, just wait. This one thing at a time. So now, if we try and get that to go up in the air... Oh, whoops. I forgot to set my stages. Wow, parachute. You're a real drag. <laughs> uh, so it doesn't have a lot of fuel, and it doesn't like, get you that far, I don't think. But it's only for landing on the moon, so it doesn't really need to be that powerful. We're going to have more stuff down below it and around it to make it extra good. I think. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, decoupler, right? Decouplers go on? Yeah, that's the good stuff. Okay, now, now we put a bunch of fuel in here. That's what the next thing, you obviously gotta put a bunch of fuel in here. If your spaceship doesn't work right, just add more fuel, guys. That's that's all you do. That's really the only thing you need to know when you're playing Kerbal Space Program. So put a couple of fuel tanks there. We'll come down here and put on a nice little, uh, a nice little, a big little, a big thing. There we go. Nope, change my mind. I want the even bigger one. There we go. I think this is a good one, right? The main sail liquid engine. A monster of an engine for heavy lifting purposes. And I am a heavy lifter. Okay, so if I'm not mistaken then, you add some decouplers to the side, radial decouplers like these ones here, okay? And you uh, will do it in threes again. There we go, three here. And uh, we'll put, put some more down here. Just like that, there we go. And now we'll add some more of these on the side to bring it up in the air. Now I don't know if you need aerodynamics here or not, because you can put little cones on top, right? You can do that. So it just looks like three penises, four penises going up into the air. That works. Now there's one thing I'm 100% sure of in this game, guys, and that is that you need to add these fuel things in here so that your fuel actually goes in to your uh, main one. I think it's called like um, onion or asparagus or something. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's named after like the layers, but this is a layer so that you take you take these guys and you fire them up in the air and then they um, and all the fuel once they leave goes back into here. So all three, all four fire at once, but this one in the middle doesn't actually lose any fuel. So I think that's how it's supposed to work here. Okay, everything is strutted and now we need to design our stages. So we got a stage one here, okay, and then these decouplers are going to go off at the same time. But all of these hit the fire at once, so we have to bring this down here to stage three. So these all fire at once, then they decouple from here, and this one will keep firing. And then, then this decouples, and the other one starts firing, and then the parachute is the last thing. Okay? Alright. Now, what else does Matt need to know before he goes on his journey to space? Anything? We could name it, I guess. I don't know what we're going to name it. We're going to call it the Iron Maiden, because it's the Maiden Voyage. You know what I mean? And it's probably made of iron at least. Oh, or, or aluminum. Who knows what this shit is made of? I don't, I'm not a, I'm not a space scientist. We have three people on board, Bill, Jeb, and Bob, and they are about to see some shit, okay? I don't remember how far you're supposed to go up before you even turn. Nothing, okay? I'm just, I'm just winging it here. Oh God, why am I turning black? What's going on here? Is this getting dark? I'm not even sure. Okay, I think I forgot to add RCS. I'm not completely sure about that. Why don't we just turn to one side, huh? Why don't we, why don't we just turn this way? I don't know, why not? 45 degree angle, sure. Okay, that ran out of fuel. We might as well decouple that. See? Ah, now we got, now we got all our fuel in the middle here. 
that's the way it is. What does the map say? Okay, okay, I see. I, I think we screwed up. I think we're going to have a huge apoapsis here. I don't think that's a very good idea. Can we just turn just this way now? Just like that, okay? All right, just like this. Oh, the space music is coming on now. You know what that means. I think we're in space or something. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Okay, we need to set ourselves a target, right? We need to we need to add a maneuver. Where's This is the moon, right? This Oh, that's the moon, all right. That's the moon, all right. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Hold, oh, okay. We'll run into the moon if we do this, right? Aha. That's what we want to do. We run, run into the moon. That's the one. We, we want to go right down into it. Something like that. So I think we should add that, that maneuver. Okay. Nope. No, I don't want one more. That's just that. We have a node in 20, 12 seconds. So if you burn a bit before and a bit after, I think that's how it works. If we don't run out of fuel first. We might run out of fuel. I don't know how we're getting home out of this. I don't think we're getting home out of this, to be honest. Just, just, you know, just to be brutally honest here. Well, well, we're flipping. Okay, we ran out of fuel, but we still got this thing. <laughs> we'll try this again now. Okay, let's just burn all our fuel out in our lander can. Who needs it anyway? I don't plan on getting back. That's the thing. I just want to go to the moon. I don't know how I'm getting back from there. You know, wasted all kinds of time putting RCS on there and didn't even bother to put in the RCS thrusters. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's me, all right. And slow it down. Nope, keep it going. Keep it going fast. Okay, stop it. Never mind. Forget it. I don't know what's going on now. Okay, we overshot, didn't we? We need to come back a bit. Okay, we need it. We need to get a maneuver going here. We need to add a maneuver that brings us back and touches the moon. See that? See that little curve over there? That's what we want. We want to keep it nice and curvy. Now we go back and we got to burn the other way, right? Wait, what the hell? What the hell is going on? Whoa, 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 whoa! I screwed something up, didn't I? I really screwed something up here. That's not what I meant to do. How do I fix this? Back the other way? Oh God! No! 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 This way. There we go. Okay. Something like that. Okay, I think we got something here that's going to encounter the moon. It seems to be spinning around it. Let's just speed up time and see what happens here, okay? If I manage to get to the moon and land on the moon, I'm going to be pretty proud of myself, considering the knowledge that I have, which is none. Okay, this looks like it's actually going to do pretty well. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Okay, now, now, now it's the big times. Look at this. We're going right along by the moon. We just need to slow ourselves down. I think we'll have enough fuel to land on the moon, right? Yeah, sure. It'll happen. If not, well, at least crash into the moon. It's close enough to landing, you know. Okay, can you burn? Can you burn a little bit? Did I run out of battery power? Did I really just run out of battery power? Because that's not good. How do I tell how much battery power I got left? Oh, crap. I was on the wrong speed and didn't realize that I thought I was on one times, that I was on two times, and that's why it wouldn't let me do it. Now I gotta go all the way back around. All right, hang on. All right, guys, we're now on a descent to the moon. So I think what we need to do now is just to speed ourselves, or slow ourselves down, sorry, as we get closer um, to try and land there. How far above are we right now? Where's where's our altitude? I don't know. Oh, here it is, 16,000 meters. I can't see anything. Why did I have to land on the dark side of the moon? What kind of an idiot does that? I don't think my spaceship has lights. Whoa, 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 what the fuck was that? But it says 3,000 meters, man. I better abort. <laughs> oh, God. This was not good. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, Kerbins. I just killed them. All right, guys. We're pretending that never happened. Our RCS is going because we don't need it. That's just extra weight, okay? And uh, I don't know if there's anything else we can do besides not be stupid this time. I think that might help if we're not stupid this time. I have a very strong feeling that it'll be better this time if we actually point in a good direction, okay? Because we want to go, I think it's east, so that we meet up with the moon that way, and we don't have as much speed to take off. I think that'll actually really decrease our fuel consumption. I'm going to go ahead and turn 45 degrees soon. I'm not sure when exactly you're supposed to do that, but I don't care. Look at all this fuel we got right now, man. Jeez, and there's the moon just hanging out over there. I don't know how i got to get to it now. But I'll figure it out. All right. Look at this. We still got... Whoa. Oh, slow down. Slow down. You're screwing this up now. We still actually have a full fuel tank that we didn't have before, which is really nice. Now, I just need to spin myself around. All right. I'm coming up around here. Taking my sweet time. Just gonna do a little do a little uh, turn around here. I'm gonna come back. 
There's gonna be a moon waiting for me, cause that's that's how life works sometimes. Look at that. Okay, we are now in the gravitational orbit of the moon. Oh crap. The moon left without us. I wonder how long it would take before the moon comes back again. Could it be? Could it be that I could actually get the moon to do this for me? Okay, hang on. Hang on, moon. Okay, okay. I know what to do now. I know what to do. I need to slow myself down. Now, I'm not going to be stupid this time. I'm going to make a nice, uh, a nice and round orbit. And when I come back, I'm going to land on this side of the moon. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Did I really run out of electric charge? Oh, Jesus. All right. I've got some battery packs on here now. What a thing to ruin your day. Not having enough batteries. All right, let's do this shit, I guess. Okay, I'm going to take a totally different approach this time, and I think it's actually the better approach, and that is to get in a smaller orbit than the moon, and then slowly meet up with the moon and get on there. You know what I mean? I think that's what you're supposed to do. I think that's what I'm going to do. So just bear with me. Do you see this here? This is exactly what I want. Now I can meet up with the freaking moon and just, just hop over for a visit. It makes perfect sense. Oh, moon, I'm coming for you. Here I am. Oh, crap, I'm coming in fast. Okay, I'm coming in fast. I'm going to... Oh, God, that's not good. That's not good at all. I think I need to speed up. I can do this. I can get out of here. Right? If I just go fast enough in one direction, I might run out of fuel, but at least I'll, you know, not die. I think. Okay, guys, this is the final descent. If this works, we could possibly land on this planet, and I think we have enough fuel. I'm not really sure, and it's not a planet, it's a moon. Shut up. Okay, would you look at this? We are on our way to the moon. I don't know how much to speed up or slow down here. I'm just going to speed it up a little bit until we get a bit closer, and then I'll just try and land it. How do you put the gear out? Is it G? G doesn't do it. You can right-click on it and lower it anyway. There you go. I'll just do it that way. Ooh, cockpit view. Look at that. Look at me in here. Is that a foot? I think that's a foot. <laughs> okay, you've got this little ball here. That's not going to help me none. Look at us. We're landing on the moon. <laughs> Hopefully. Just trying to cancel out velocities. The velocity thing right here shows you what direction you're going in. Well, the opposite of what direction you're going in. You just cancel it out and you lower yourself to the planet. And the problem is... That altitude meter is not right. You're not actually 6,000 above. You're pretty damn close. That's a, that's a big thing. You need to you need to think about and worry about. I'm worried. Are you? Okay. You can see you can see the shadow over there. Look at that thing. I love it. Okay. I don't know what speed you're supposed to land at, but I'll go as slow as I can when I land. Where'd the shadow go? Where's the, oh, there. Oh it's, oh, it's back. Okay, we're good. Oh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna land on the moon. Drop it like it's hot. Whoa, oh, too much. You dropped it too much. Well, you, you, you didn't drop it. You went the other way. You need to drop it. And gently. Oh, okay, stop, stop. We made it. We're on the moon. <laughs> oh, it's been a long time since I did this. I love this game so much, guys. It is awesome. How do we get out again? What's the button for getting out? You guys want to get out? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bring, uh, bring Bob out. Let's do, let's do this EVA. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let go. Hey. Okay. Oh, oh you okay, bud? Get back up. You always get back on your feet. Now we just need to plant a flag, I guess. I'm not going to go too far away because I don't want to die. I don't know how much fuel I have in this thing. Okay, not that much. Good. Not good, but, you know, cool. All right, buddy. How do you place a flag? Plant flag. Look at that. Here we do. Here we go. Here we do, I was going to say. Yeah, here we do. Oh. Oh. There. We oh, we can't even see it. <laughs> there it is, kind of. Okay. <laughs> oh, we need a site name. Let's call this thing the beginning, because this is where it all started. I don't know how I did it, but I did. <laughs> all right, there you have it, guys. This was Kerbal Space Program. I actually managed to land on the moon. It took me quite a long time, but I want to know what you guys think. Do you want to see more Kerbal Space Program? Because like I said, by default, this is going to be a series because I just love this game, and I've always wanted to make a series on it, and now it just went into beta. So, you know, why not start right now? So here it is. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.